Hey guys, Jessica Damu here with another custom Gundam MSI review. This is another custom recolor I've made for my rat friend Richard Cofield. He's making me a 3D printed big tray in trade. So he sent me a Ramba Rawl Zaku 1, and I turned it into this. And, uh, yeah, I, I basically do this with fabric dye, and there's a method to it that I'm going to publish here on YouTube, along with all of my, uh, you know, findings and stuff, because knowing what color blue turns in cocoa brown dye is important to know ahead of time when you're trying to make something. And so this guy was an experiment. I'd never tried blue with the cocoa dye, or cocoa brown. I was hoping to make a brown Zaku 1. It didn't quite work. Uh, it did originally, but the, as the dye set in, it, it turned more of a green, a metallic -y green, which is actually quite cool. In order to do this, I had to remove the paint from the lower torso. Then I had to dye the upper torso blue so that it matched the lower torso. And uh, you can see the shade difference. The shade difference in those blues was there, was still there. And in the end result, there's a shade difference between our chest and our lower torso, quite considerably, really. So the upper torso is brown. Lower torso is, you know, this greenish brown type color. The arms and legs I boiled in vinegar to lighten them, to lighten their shade for when I dyed them, so that they would contrast with the body. I'm not really sure that ended up working, though it, it probably did, just subtly. My, uh, I don't always have the best, like, shade perception sometimes when it comes to colors. So I'm sure it's there, helping him look cooler. But yeah, it came out this neat metallic-y green color. Backpack is dyed as well. The cool thing about this, you know, is, as always, the color won't scratch off, so it's ready for play or display. Like I said, I'm going to be posting everything I've learned about this over the last couple years. I still offer the service of making it for you, though, as uh, I've got all the materials and the know-how of what colors make what, at least most of the time. Like I said, this one was, or in case I didn't say, this one was an experiment, because I hadn't really tried it with this type of blue before. Cut. The results were quite nice. It's about time to have a variation of the Zaku one that isn't green and blue or blue. And uh, yeah, I really like how it turned out. I think it came out good. Well, I hope you enjoyed the review. Make sure to like, favorite, and subscribe as I post a new video nearly every day. And check out my eBay store. There's a link down below in the more info area. You'll find some of my customs there too.